Hello friends, it's me. And today we are watching a Darman video about a dad who can't buy Christmas presents for his kids. Grab a drinky drink or a snacky snack and let's watch. Dad, come check this out. We found a tree we like a lot. Let's go check it out. This one right here? Oh wow, this is really nice. <laughs> oh. You know, ever since Mrs. Gonzalez's business shut down and I'm back to working at the mall, this is a little out of our price range. Charging $200 for a fake tree, that is robbery. How much money you got in that wallet? There's like at least $25 in there. Goodwill got trees? Growing up, we had a tiny little fake Christmas tree that my parents brought for like $20 max. And we had that for like 10 years until I started making money and paying my family. What do you think? She's a big beaut, ain't she? You are a scammer. Yeah. If I live in I should be living in Do you happen to have yard. other more affordable options? Say something under 50? $50, huh? Uh, actually, we do. Uh, this one right here. And she's actually 50% off because, you know, ain't nobody want to buy her. Ain't nobody want to buy her. That was unnecessary. I mean, I know it's not the same thing that we used to get when mom it's was around, okay, but- It's okay, Dad. Don't worry about it. You don't have to explain it to us. That one's perfect. Let's go get it. Come on. I feel like when you grow up poor, you're just used to being told no or we'll see and then it just never happens. It sucks for kids who like used to have money and then their parents lost it. They don't understand and they're like, but I've gotten the new iPhone every single year since I was three years old. Maybe that's why your parents went broke. Oh, excuse me, sir. I was going to get that. <laughs> Sorry, pal. I got to it first. He just said she's half off because nobody wants her and then this dude just spawned. Like, no, she's mine. Get your own tree, brokey. Do you have any other options in this price range? Unfortunately, uh, no. Y'all act like this is the only Christmas tree dealer in town. Y'all can't go to Walmart. Get paid tomorrow. We'll go to Bullseye and I'm sure they're gonna have more options there. proud of himself like yeah I just ruined Christmas for this family I'm gonna go home give my wife a high five and ruin someone else's day tomorrow how are you going to charge me an insufficient funds fee and a late payment fee how am I supposed to keep up with all my payments when you keep adding all these extra charges dad I really need your help with what don't you see he's on the phone are you not terrified of interrupting your parents when they're angry on the phone you're putting marshmallows on a stick what could you possibly need help with and I just give me a sec, okay? Just keep me on auto pay and stop adding all these extra fees. I never would have rented this house had I known that I was gonna lose my new job a week after. All right, what's going on, honey? I have to do this catapult for these marshmallows for class, but I can't seem to figure it out. It's impossible. Hey, whatever I always tell you, there's nothing a family can't solve. As long as we work together. First, we gotta form a triangle, right? Now, we are going to turn it into wait turn. i feel like i've done this before this right? is like a real thing now let's see i don't remember it being a catapult though give me your rubber band i don't know i couldn't find one well you can't have a catapult without a rubber band you literally had one job girl give me a hair tie oh like oh, okay this. there we go see oh. she's smart perfect all right about there okay now give me the tape I looked, I couldn't find any. Oh boy. I think I know who the favorite daughter is. I know she didn't look. Okay, hold this. Don't eat the marshmallows. Okay. Mm, busted out a toolkit for some tape. Wow, so organized. All right, get the spoon, honey. Thank you. Right. Dad basically did the project for her. And look at that. We have a catapult. Problem solved, huh? I'm gonna get you. <laughs> Where you Whoa. going? Where you going? <laughs> okay, that's pretty cool. All right, who's next? Who's next? Yeah, I'm pretty sure he did this in school. Now, how are we gonna solve our bigger problem? What do you mean our problem? Are y'all gonna get a job and pay for rent? I'm gonna have to do something that I've been dreading to do. Please don't tell me he's gonna start our OnlyFans. Oh, is he a mechanic? Oh, Miguel, thanks for fixing that. I was waiting for the day it would just fall and hit a customer on the head. <laughs> <laughs> I'm happy to help. Oh, can you tell me the time? Oh, I'm sorry, I don't have my phone. Do you not have a phone? Oh, you want to know the secret? This watch hasn't worked Nobody's in watch actually works. <laughs> and if it does, the time is usually incorrect. Hey, bud. Look what your dad got. No way. You got me the extra big tree? 
This is gonna be the best Christmas ever. The extra big tree? Let me get a good look at that. Six and a half feet, that's average. Pardon me, Miguel? Five. I heard you wanted to speak with me, and I need to speak with you as well. Hey, it's all um, the characters from the other episode. I hate to ask for anything, but... Well, she's just a well, principal, now she's a manager. Is there any way that I can get an advance? You know, it's the holidays, and I've got two girls. I'll pay it all back by January. I can work doubles. Overnight. I would love to do that, but the truth is, oh gosh, this is awful. We have to let you go. <gasps> what did he do? Also, he's like a mechanic, a contractor, whatever. He fixes things. There's so much demand for that. Like Task Rabbit. Hello. What? Angie's Why? list or whatever. I show up early. I work very hard. No complaints. No, it's not you. I love having you here. It is the company is just making cuts. And you're the first to go. Here's your final paycheck. Oh, well, at least you got that advance you I'm wanted. so sorry. Aw. That must be so hard, firing somebody. And right before Christmas, too? I don't think I could ever fire anybody. I'm gonna let you open one of your Christmas gifts early. No way. You got me a drone? You're the best dad ever. <laughs> Be doing this in the middle of the target you know perfect place to unbox a 300 dollars present from this dude who just got fired yeah well, look what i got my son look at it it's a drone do you know how much this cost me probably more than your paycheck bro he's just rubbing it in his face Liver a jiggle merch dad can you get me this for christmas why are you taking your kids shopping for things that you can't afford? Why even take them shopping in the first place? Loki, my parents used to do this too. Oh, you want to go to the toy store? You can't buy anything, but like you can look. And now I'm just realizing like how awful that is. Just stay home. I know how much you love her, but look. Look, a $15 hoodie and we can just print a picture of Olivia Rodrigo on it. It's basically the same thing. What about this hoodie? Go better with your clothes, right? What happens next year when you don't like Olivia Rodrigo anymore and you're a Swifty? You're gonna be wishing you got that gray hoodie. They're sewed out of trees, but I picked out some decorations for us. Ma'am, you did what now? What is this? Suburban Mom Simulator? Hey, let's go to Target and just fill up a cart with decor. Do you have any idea how expensive that is? Does she not have a concept of money? Yeah, they are. Let me guess which one it was. The one who couldn't but find the tape? No, our place is so small. Oh no, it's the other one. Do we really need all these oh. decorations? I guess not. Yeah, put it back. Which do you think we should keep? What if we just used last year's decorations? That's what you're supposed to do! You know, we had decor, a tree, and one set of lights, and then we would use it every single year. Who buying new decor every year? I thought you said you didn't want to because they reminded you of... Oh. Well... Okay, well now I feel like a jerk. If we're not gonna get any presents or decorations, then why did we come here? True. The girl who can't find the tape found some common sense. Truth is, girls, I got fired today. Right before Christmas? I'm so sorry. Don't say sorry. It's not your fault. Honestly, we don't even need presents. Aw, at or least the understanding. We don't even have to celebrate this year. That is not an option. You know how important tradition was to your mom? We have to celebrate. Like, you don't need to buy a bunch of fancy hoodie, stuff to celebrate. And we will pay for all these decorations, Laura. I'll figure it out. My family used to take us to like drive around, look at the Christmas lights, and then we would go home and have hot cocoa. We didn't get fancy presents. They barely spent any money. We still had a good time because we were together as a family. I told you girls to pick something. It's not like we have no money. We're not gonna let you spend everything you have on decorations and presents. Don't we still have rent to pay? What are we gonna do? I said I would take care of it, okay? Just trust your dad. I'll just have to find another way to make money. This isn't just your problem, Dad. It's all of ours. Yeah, let me and Laura help. Absolutely not, okay? It's my responsibility. I'm the parent. Why do they keep adding all these fees? That would piss me off so much. Like, I said I was going to pay it. And then they keep adding, adding, adding. Ugh! Late fees should be illegal. I'll get it. I'm sorry to bother you, uh, but I've been trying to hang my wreath, and I'm wondering if, if I could pay you Twenty dollars if you could hang it for me. It's like two minutes of work. You know, Heck my yeah. Used to do all this kind of stuff, but now that he's gone, it's no problem at all. Okay, of course I will help you. I'll come over next door in a little bit. Let me just get my toolbox. Mm -hmm. And don't worry about having to pay me anything. Are you sure? Of course. I'll do it for free. That's what neighbors like are for. Like right? taking money from a rich old person. Thank you so much. Dad, that's it. 
You could charge people to hang up their Christmas decorations. Yeah. Uh, no. Why not? I'm not gonna charge our neighbor. Maybe not the neighbor, but like everybody else. You have any idea how much they charge me to hang my lights? Just like the most basic lights? $4,000. No, I'm pretty sure it was more than that actually. But wait, wait. My friend, my friend is rich. Her house is like crazy. They quoted her for over $50,000 to hang lights on her house. She doesn't even get to keep the lights. Just like, we'll put them off. You can borrow them for the holidays and then we take them off. The the light hanging business is no joke. They be making bank and they only gotta work like two months out of the year. She's such a sweet lady. I'm not talking so, yeah. about Mrs. Stewart. I'm go saying ahead, you can money. go out and charge other people. Yeah, Laura's right. You can pretty much fix anything. Well, even if I can do the work, where am I gonna go find my customers? I can make flyers and we could pass them out around the neighborhood. Yeah, we can knock on doors. Oh, that's gonna be creepy when this random man shows up at people's doorsteps. <laughs> My dad made us do this too. Back in the day when I was growing up, he had a fix-it company and we would like go door to door and hand out flyers. Now when he has his two daughters with him. Come on, dad, what do you have to lose? I don't want to involve you in all of this. You shouldn't have to be worried about making money. Yeah, there's two kinds of dads. This guy and my dad that took full advantage of us for free child labor. Don't you always say there's nothing family can't solve as long as we work together? Unless you didn't mean it. I didn't. Yeah, are you fake? Did you not mean it? Do you not actually then love us? And let them let help, us help you. Let help you. Ugh, fine. You are just like your mother. The so you see should be, you should never be afraid to ask somebody for help. That's the message I want to hear. Miguel's merry makeovers, yeah. And they're dressed up. Yo, what is this? People still answer their doors? I never answer my door. I don't care who you are. I wait for the delivery person to leave. You drop off the food and you go. A hundred dollars in 2023? You know, they really be charging that to hang up a wreath on the wall like with a hammer and a nail. I'm telling you, this is actually a really good way to make money. Like, this is no joke. Like, you can make thousands doing this. Like, if obviously, if you actually know you how like to do mouth? it. Yes, please. And you're not like super slow. Man, they made bank this holiday season. I mean, this is the time to make money. It looks like it's gonna be a great Christmas after all. Yeah, yo. All in a day's work. If you need anyone to hang on with decorations here, you can call my dad. He's the best. We got a future PR person right here. Just call my dad. All right, that'll be $478.92. Oh, now y'all are balling. <laughs> yeah, I really hope you got that decor at like at least 20% off. Do you have another off. form of payment you could try? No, but I was just at the bank. Wait, what's going on? Give me a second, please. Dad, Maybe it's a late piece. Okay. I'm trying to figure it out. Oh, <gasps> no. Oh, no. 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 The auto pay for the, the rent. rent payment came out. It was set for auto debit. Is there anything left? Not with all these fees. So what do you want to do? You want to put everything back or? You want to put everything back? Bro, my card just declined. You think I'm going to take my card and then put everything back? Property management office is closed. I can't believe this. After all the hard work you girls put in, all that money just disappeared. I'm so sorry that I can't give you the Christmas you deserve. I let you both down. That's almost no, $4,000 rent. Like, you don't feel bad. Where y'all live? <laughs> I feel like such a terrible father. By this time, this whole place would be so Christmassy. If mom were here, she'd know what to do. She always knew how to fix everything. Feels like Thanksgiving all over again. I have an idea. I know how we're gonna save Christmas. <sighs> oh, it's already Christmas? Merry Christmas! Hey, where'd they get that from? Wait, <laughs> am I dreaming? <laughs> No, you're not dreaming. And then I did this all yesterday while you were sleeping. But how? Where did you get the money to buy all this stuff? We did it. It's all DIY, using stuff from around the house. With the little inspo from Pinterest. For the snowman, I cut off the top of the sock, and then I filled it up with a small cup of rice. 
Hey, we need that rice. We eat that for dinner. Yeah, like you don't need to spend a ton of money on new decorations. There's literally so many things that you can make. Mm -hmm. Then I added some stuffing from my pillow <laughs> to make it rounder. I tied off the bottom with a piece of thread to make the body. And then I did it all over again to make the head. Then I used the top of the sock I cut off earlier. Okay, we got a future hacks that. YouTuber over here. I found some old buttons and glue from your toolkit. M&Ms for the eyes, string sticks for the hands, and... You use M&Ms for the eyes, I'm gonna eat them right off. Well, <laughs> as snowman, we didn't have to spend any money to make. For the snowflakes, I used coat hangers from my closet and some tape. I taped the long sides together. <sighs> okay, this gotta be I definitely on five minute crafts. I kept repeating the process until we got this. Oh, it, it kind of still this looks like unbelievable. a coat hanger. The garland we were able to make using old fabric we found around the house. The stockings were made from cardstock and fabric. Wait, how did you get... The tree was the trickiest part. Okay, how did I you make a Facebook tree? Marketplace, and luckily a girl from my school was wanting to get rid of hers with ornaments and everything. Her mom dropped it off. Oh, that's so nice. Facebook Marketplace kind of crazy. There are so many people giving away free stuff. Like, oh, I don't want this anymore. Come pick it up. Without a doubt, you can find a free Christmas tree on there. Decor, all of that. Also incredible. You made a stocking for your mom. And don't think we forgot about the presents. What is this? It's a flyer. Christmas tree removal service. <laughs> Merry Christmas, Dad. Here's your new job. I figured that's how you can make some money until you find another job. Open my next. <laughs> oh, this. You fixed my watch? How did you? You can learn anything from TikTok. <laughs> Facts. I love all this so much. I feel terrible I didn't get you anything. What more could we ask for? We already have the best dad in the world. Yeah, honestly, a lot of people can't say that. Oh, and they lived happily ever so after. what are we doing for New Year's? <laughs> <laughs> Ugh, not another money spending holiday. Like, what do you mean? What are we doing for New Year's? Y'all gonna sit on this couch, throw a bag of popcorn in the microwave, and watch the ball drop in New York City on TV. Isn't that what you're supposed to do? But anyways, that's all for today. I hope you guys enjoyed this video. If you did, make sure to hit that like button in the face. And make sure you turn on notifications. Click, click. And I just released some new merch. We got hoodies, shirts, tank tops at ogwolfpack.com. I'll link it below. And subscribe to the Wolf Pack. And subscribe to Darman. I love you guys so much. Thanks for watching. Bye guys